Well, from college walk on to All American and soon to be NFL draft choice. Former North Point Christian standout Kenny Willickus joining us now from his home in West Michigan. And Kenny, first and foremost, glad to hear you and your family are well. Four or five years ago, there weren't a lot of people who would have believed that this is the position you would be in now. What kept you believing, and you know what will being drafted into the NFL mean to you? Yeah, you know, being drafted uh, in the NFL to me has always been a dream of mine. You know, it's been something I've been working for for a long time. My dad always taught me, you know, if you're going to put your name on something, if uh, you're going to try to do something, you know, give it everything you got. And, uh, you know, that's what I feel like I've done. Uh, you know, I went to Michigan State with, uh, you know, I wanted to go in there, prove myself and, uh, you know, earn a spot on the team, earn a scholarship. You know, once I did that, the next step was to, you know, earn a starting spot, earn playing time. And then, you know, once we were able to get that, I wanted to, uh, you know, have a shot at the NFL when I was all said and done. And, you know, I was able to put in the work, uh, you know, I was surrounding myself with good people that, you know, pushed me and I was able to put in the work and put myself in this position. Hey, you had a great tweet a week ago or so, not only with the workout video, obviously, but from all those quotes from people who have, you know, doubted some of your abilities uh, relative, obviously, to the NFL level. How much of a motivation is that stuff to you? Um, you know, I use that as motivation. Uh, you know, I think I'm someone that's intrinsically motivated. Uh, it doesn't matter if someone's going to doubt me or if someone's going to pat me on the back and tell me good job. You know, I'm still going to give everything I have. But, you know, having that little bit of extra chip on your shoulder that pushes you a little bit harder, uh, you know, that helps me. Um, there's a lot of people that say that you know, I'm not athletic enough. You know, I can't do this, can't do that. And, uh, you know, I think I have a pretty unique uh, athletic skill set, uh, you know, with my mobility and uh, the way I can move my body and play defensive end. So I was hoping this video would kind of show people that. Obviously, you did a lot of your working out. I know, Kenny, prior to the uh, the combine, and congratulations on a great showing there. Um, what is it like now for you with the you know the coronavirus and all the regulations that we have, and you know how are you going about preparing? Because I'm sure you wanted to you know keep working out, going into what at least normally would be some kind of mini camp coming up after the draft. Uh, yeah, it's definitely a little bit different, but uh, you know even through uh, this uncertain time, I still have to make sure I'm prepared and ready to go. Um, I've been working out at a private gym with my mentor, and, uh, you know, continuing to work out six days a week. And so, you know, when we can't get back to regular activities and when it is time for me to go to an NFL camp, you know, I'm ready to go, ready to compete. Well, hey, we appreciate you taking the time to do this. We wish you best of luck, and I think everybody's excited to see where you go and when you go. I'm assuming from your point, you don't really care where you just want to get in, eh? Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter to me. Uh, you know, wherever I go, I'm going to go and work hard, bust my tail, and we'll see what happens from there. Uh, we're looking forward to it. Thanks for doing this again, Kenny. Good luck to you. No, no problem. Thank you for having me on.